Hello, all you pocket rockets, and welcome to another episode of Pocket Monsters Yellow, also known as Pokemon Yellow. So, I must say, I am impressed you got here. So, um, some of my team members are going to be different levels and or different healths and stuff like that because I had to replay the last 30 minutes or so. So, yeah, because uh, I recorded an episode, then it, then it, the, the file got corrupted, the recording file got corrupted, and I had to replay from, um, I basically had to replay an entire episode. No. But, we are back, we have the same team. I'm a little bit more healed this time because I went back and healed before I ran into this guy. Not that I really needed to necessarily because I beat him just fine last time. But I figured I might as well because I'm not recording so I don't actually need to worry about wasting time. Hey, that's mean. Um, I also, I think I taught Counter and Hypnosis to Albatross last time, when I ran into him, I don't remember. I don't, I don't, re oops, I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> but I know that I taught Meditate to Vanilla in the previous episode, however, it doesn't really help him much. So when I picked it up this time, I decided to teach it to Miracle. I made him forget Constrict so that he could learn Meditate, because it'll be much more useful on him or Pikachu than it will on pretty much anybody else. Alakazam! Let's, uh... Let's get Mr. Krabs some experience. Ooh. Somebody's ready for their Wheaties. He might even try taking mine. He does have two spoons. We're gonna go ahead and toss out Miracle. Because Alakazam is extremely powerful. <laughs> And none of my low levels are going to stand any chance against him, so... See? I got Meditate. My accuracy, though. That sucks. But my attack rose! Make me proud! Hey. Hey. I raise my attack and you raise your defense. This isn't fair. Okay, he lowered my accuracy once, and I can't hit him now. Wow, he really is powerful. I forgot how powerful he was. Uh, it's kind of pointless for me to use Body Slam or... Wow. Or headbutt, because he he raised his defense. I'm probably gonna have to swap out because he's lowered my accuracy so much I can't hit him. Oh God! All right, sorry, Miracle, but I have to swap you out because you just can't do anything anymore. <laughs> I don't really want to pull Pikachu out here because, wow. Um, I'm gonna risk it. Uh, 
Oh my god. Do not critical me, please. Okay. I'm gonna heal. I probably have more... More potions than I did before because I went back and I healed when I needed to as opposed to using potions. Okay. This should finish him. Okay. That was actually a lot harder than I... Than I, uh... Than it was the first time. What? This cannot be! Ooh, I get money. I see that you raise Pokemon with utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. He pooped. He pooped out a silph scope. Which was the entire point of coming here. What's over here? I don't remember. Something's on the table! It's a soda pop! That was exciting. So... I'm going to face the gym next. But in order to go to the gym, I have to have cut. And I'm not just going to teach it to somebody on my team right now, because I have a main party member that knows Cut already. So I'm actually just going to swap out Fartzilla for Hottie. Because Hottie knows Cut, and Fartzilla's not that useful right now. After I'm done with the gym, I may swap them back. But for now, I need to make a party change because of the reasons I have already stated. Hadi! And hopefully I'll be able to do the entire gym this episode. But I kind of doubt I will. Because I think there's like... Six trainers, I think, in there. Including the... The gym leader. I think. I could be wrong about that, but I think so. Yay, hottie! I've missed you. Not especially, actually. Huddy is definitely useful. But... What are you doing? Hehe, <laughs> this gym is great! It's full of women! Oh, good job. You can tell this is an early Nintendo game, because there's a pervert! You're not allowed in here! I'm pretty sure, since I'm a trainer, I'm allowed in here. But I guess what the boss says, the boss, uh, gets. The boss makes the rules, whatever. High jump kick! Come on. There we go. Oh. I didn't actually realize that was super effective. I thought maybe it would be. I, I wasn't sure. Kabutops. Actually, no. Because I'm just going to high jump kick again. Because, uh, oh god. Not very effective. Did half my health. Super effective. Killed him. Sweet, sweet experience. You're too rough. I thought you liked it rough, baby. I was getting bored. Well, that's kind of what happens when you spend all day every day just standing around doing nothing. Execute. He's so cute. Execute, to be precise. 
we'll go ahead and uh, just have vanilla wipe him out because might as well oh you're special greatly Rose that's cool I have an offensive uh, physical attack of course it's offensive if it's, a, if it's an attack <laughs> Golding, Golding. Um, I think before I had actually used Mr. Krabs on that, but since Mr. Krabs is at half health already, I'm not gonna do it. So I'm just gonna wipe it out. And by the way, Mr. Krabs did win. He went one on one with Goldine and won. Yeah. That's how, that's how badass Mr. Krabs is. It was kind of a long drawn out fight though. <laughs> Hitmonchan. Let's get Hottie in here. Wait, is that a good idea? Yeah, actually that's fine, never mind. I was... I was thinking for some reason fighting is strong against fire, but it's not. I mean, that that hurt like hell, but... But, uh, I was, I was thinking more along the lines of... I... One of my favorite Pokemon is Metagross. And he's weak to both fire and fighting, and so that's where I got that in my head. I don't know why I chose Clamp, actually. And I didn't mean to choose it again. I thought it was going for another turn. Oh well. Bill Sprout. We'll get Hottie some more experience. Not gonna keep Hottie out, though, because Bill Sprout's strong against him. But then we'll switch back to Hottie. Because Bellsprout is weak to Hottie. Though Hottie is not exactly strong to Bellsprout. You poisoned me. Dick move, man. I'll cut you down like the weed you are. And apparently accomplish nothing. <laughs> wow, that was... Oh, He's splashing in the dirt. Um... Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Because he's apparently hitting me regardless. Wow. I guess I'll screech and then cut. May have to heal, actually. <laughs> uh, I love watching him splash. Oh, thank you. That's so nice of you. I said I loved it, and he's like, Okay, here you go. Come on, hottie. <clears throat> Don't fail me. Thank you. That was kind of tedious. My makeup! And because I don't actually feel like going back to heal yet, mostly for time purposes and I don't feel like editing it, I'm just going to go ahead and antidote and look at my grass Pokemon. Another rider. Jigglypuff! Jiggly Puff Albatross Ooh That's quite a roar you got Isn't that like supposed to knock me out of battle or something? Oh no, don't do this
<sighs> no. <laughs> wow, I actually hit that. While it's asleep, I'm just gonna miss it. Logically speaking, if it's asleep, how am I missing? <laughs> because it's supposed to be technically dodging, you know? Not so much me missing, but... Jigglypuff is so good it dodges in its sleep. That actually didn't take nearly as long to take him, take Jigglypuff down as I thought it would, because of the double team. Paras! Actually, you know what? I'm gonna get Albatross some experience. Just alone. <laughs> wow! I actually didn't think that was super effective. Yes. All right, there's another one over here. I am not the peeping tom. If I was, I'd be failing at my job because I'm actually in your face. Peeping toms generally aren't supposed to be, you know, caught. Because I don't know if Voltorb has any electric moves or not. See? The majority of my team is very weak to electric. However, the couple that aren't can more than make up for it. Uh, PikaCon and Miracle. And I guess Hottie's not weak to it either, but... Hottie can't really make up for it. Oddish. Um, this might be a little dangerous. But I think I'm gonna tr try it. No, never mind. That's a stupid idea. <laughs> I don't have anything that can really work against it, so. I'm just gonna get Albatross some experience and toss out Vanilla. I was thinking that I was actually gonna fight it with Albatross, but it's like... There is nothing that I can do against that that would actually be even remotely effective. And it is super effective against me, so... And I really appreciate you poisoning me and then dying. I'm in shock. Because now I have to use another antidote. What a bitch. Okay. I forgot I have to actually do it manually. Oh. So there are a lot more trainers in here than I thought there were. Well, one more than I thought there was, so I guess that's not a lot more, but... I was imitating Lickitung there, and I said, my name is Lickitung. What am I doing? <laughs> Why... I don't know why I just risked that. He's just normal type, right? For some reason, part of me wants to say he's also water type, but he's not. I don't know why. Maybe because tongue, slimy, water, you know, that sort of stuff. I don't know. He's got double team and double slap. I never really understood why double team was named double team okay he used it once and I can't hit him <clears throat> so 
So I'm probably not going to be finishing the gym this episode. Because I have three more trainers to go through after I beat this one. And this is taking forever. Somehow I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to miss my counter. <gasps> I didn't! Really? Screw this! <laughs> this is just annoying. I thought for sure that would kill him. It did basically no damage, so... Well, Albatross still went up a level, so that's good. Yes. This is a little risky, because Mr. Krabs doesn't have very good defense, but... Come on. Okay. I was a little worried there. But I remembered that his high jump kick is very effective, so I figured I might as well get him some extra experience. I think I'm gonna heal. And go down here and heal Hottie. Because Hottie's actually, uh, he's fallen behind in levels. So I'm pretty sure the black haired girl. Better un better not underestimate girl power. Are you gonna tell me what you want, what you really, really want? But I'm pretty sure the black haired girl is the gym leader. I didn't actually finish this gym last time I did this. Cause I ran out of time. I wanted to, but it just wasn't in the cards, babe. Mr. Krabs is becoming a force to be reckoned with. Nope. I remember you, Vulpix. You're a little bastard with your fire spin, I think it was. Ow. That actually hurt a lot. Okay, good. And the critical hit to make sure he dies. Goofing. Um, let's try another high jump kick. Not very effective. I thought it would be, like, normal at least. Let's crab hammer then. Ooh. That was bad. I didn't want to use Waterfall because if his coughing or her coughing is anything like my wheezing, it's got really high special. Oh, beaten. I may actually be able to do this. Pleased to meet you. My hobby is Pokemon training. Really? Never would have guessed it. Never. Splash Sprout! Uh, <laughs> Let's not do Hottie again. Because that was just, just kind of worthless last time. <laughs> so we'll just take this out quickly so we can get on and finish this gym. Ooh. I clicked through that a little bit faster than I meant. I mean, Ice Punch should still kill it despite it raising its defense, but... But I would have preferred to use the Ice Beam. Oh, splendid! Yes, I love being beaten as well. We're gonna heal Mr. Grabs, so that if I decide I want to use him in this battle, I can. Hello. Lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. 
Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I'm the leader of Celadon Gym. I teach the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are of the grass type. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Wow. She's a special kind of stupid, isn't she? <laughs> and her name is Wayne. <gasps> no! You don't do that to Mr. Krabs. Mr. Krabs remembers. You do not do that to Mr. Krabs. Oh, damn, that was actually pretty effective. And very delayed. As long as you don't explode it in my face. Oh, wow. Um, I'm gonna heal. I'm kind of worried about this thing. Because <laughs> if it does have self-destruct... And despite that, Tri-Attack is actually really fucking effective. Holy crap. Twenty-four damage. That actually... That was actually difficult. Splash! I know, Mr. Krabs, I know you want to learn Splash so badly, but I'm sorry. You're not Bellsprout. Bulbasaur. We will actually go ahead and get Hottie some experience out of this. Wow, level 32. But I'm actually going to be swapping to vanilla because <sighs> because Hottie is yet to learn a fire move and I'm so so annoyed by that I really am thanks for poisoning me jerk 29 Venonat that's kind of a strange last Pokemon. Um, we'll get Albatross some experience. Probably not gonna fight it with Albatross though. Cause that's an 11 level difference. I guess. We haven't seen it nearly enough headbutts this episode. Man, what is with this poison? There's supposed to be grass type. Headbutt! Wow, that was actually extremely... I mean, he's strong as hell, without a doubt, but... I was expecting to do about half of... half health, maybe? Not like three fours. I defeated Wayne! Oh, I concede defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer you the Rainbow Badge. The Rainbow Badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokemon to use strength in and out of battle. Please also take this with you. Tanuki received TM21. Contains Leech Sten. Leech Sten. Error. Um... I'm going to go back and heal, and then we will end this episode. Ow. That's not going to kill anybody, is it? No. We're fine. You still peeking? Yep. Creepy old men in video games. Thank you, Game Freak. Anyway, this has been an episode 
remember there are all sorts of things you can vote for. We now have two revives once again. Since I just finished a gym. So if you would like anybody to be revived, that's taking the long way. Is there anything up there? Fresh water! I actually had no idea that was there. I was just kind of guessing. But we have all sorts of revives. And if you would like me to put Fartzilla back on the team, instead of Hottie, or instead of anybody really, go ahead and vote for that as well. Or you can swap anybody, you know. Voting makes this game a lot more interesting and a lot more fun. Because then you guys can choose what you want me to do and how you want me to do it, basically. So once again, revives, team swaps, daycare, all sorts of votes. Uh, more details are in the are in the uh, end slate. If you're more, if you're unsure. So thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys next episode for more Pokemon Yellow.